Reverend Jen Burns is cooking without red meat. It's a heart healthy meal day. But when she is, it tastes so good. <laughs> but it is going to taste good too. She's in the Fox 13 Cafe with a guest doctor making some whole wheat wraps with turkey. Yep. And I know that you both like curry, so we're even we adding in a little curry in for you too. Yes, I am here with a very special guest. I'm here with Dr. Muelstein, who is a cardiologist at Intermountain Medical Center Heart Institute. Thanks for coming and cooking with me. Thank you. My pleasure. All right. So when you come to cook with me, can I put you to a little bit of work here? You just, can. Okay. If you can just dice up this, um, this is just a cucumber with the English. We can leave the skin on. We can just start dicing that up. Okay. I'll get the tomato and the onion going for our curried turkey wraps that are going to be put into whole Oops, wheat sorry. wraps there. Uh, is this doctor approved? so far? Yes, so okay. far. Okay. <laughs> it right. looks very healthy. Yeah, doctor, let's talk about that and, and your approval on some of these things with food. Now, food and our diet plays such a role in the development of heart disease. Tell me your thoughts on what you feel people should be eating and putting in their diet. Yes, actually, as you think about it, diet, probably the food we eat is probably the biggest amount of medicine that we take because we eat more of it than anything else. And there's been a lot of ideas about what might be the most appropriate things to eat to make these most heart healthy. And a lot of them have been around the proposal of low-fat diets. And sometimes those are not particularly tasty and then for it's hard to do. And it's a But recently, there have been recent studies that have demonstrated perhaps the safest and most effective diet to reduce risk of heart disease is the Mediterranean diet. Mm -hmm. Mediterranean diet tastes good. If you think of going to Italy and living, having what they eat in Italy on vacation or something, that would be something that you can eat. Several studies have demonstrated that an olive oil based Mediterranean diet reduces your chances of heart attack much better than a low fat diet. Okay. All right. That's really good information. Now, with heart disease, you know, doctor, there is just, I mean, it's just almost overwhelming with the amount of people getting heart disease. Are we ever going to have a handle on this? I think we can, and we actually have had some success over the past decade or 20 years. We have reduced the incidence of heart disease, but we still have a long ways to go. A lot of things we can do is stop doing things that we know hurt, like smoking and drinking too much alcohol. And, and eating french fries all the eating time. Eating french fries all the time. <laughs> and now we have data that tell us what sort of things might be better to eat uh, that will make it healthy. Okay. We've then learned that perhaps red meat might not be the best thing to do all the time. And by so doing, we can improve ourselves. Then if we check our numbers, check our cholesterol and our blood pressure and make sure we don't become a diabetic and so forth, we can have a strong impact on reducing heart disease. Okay. I'm glad to hear that and that's good information being that I just got back from Italy uh, just a little while back. I, I am one of those people that think about living there with that delicious food. So, okay. We're going to finish up this um, delicious salad. We'll put the curry dressing on the next segment. We'll put it together and then we're going to make the wraps and guess what? We're going to eat them. <laughs> Good to me. <laughs> and we're going to share with Carrie and Dan and Damon. Yeah. And he sounds like he knows a thing or two. I'll take it from him. Exactly. Thanks. Yes, yes. For the full recipe, just visit fox13now.com and search curried turkey wraps. Did you know that before you came here? Well, it's time to check in on Jennifer Burns and see what she's got cooking. She's got heart-healthy wraps with her guest in the Fox 13 Cafe with Dr. Muelstein out there. Hello, Jennifer. Hello. And we are going to put a little bit of curry in them now to season them and make them even better. I am here, um, absolutely, like you said, down with Dr. Muelstein, who is a cardiologist at Intermountain Medical Center Heart Institute. And you have been a great help in helping so far oh, with these you. curried turkey whole wheat wraps that we're making here. So I'll just recap what we did right here, doctors. Um, you helped us out with, uh, helped me out with doing some of the cucumber. We used uh, the English one so you don't have to peel it, just wash it well. Some of that onion is in there and then the already cooked turkey, which is of course the white meat and probably a little bit better for us, like you were saying earlier, on not having so much red meat in your diet. So let's talk a little bit about what are you doing at Intermount Medical Center um, right now on heart research? Yeah, we have a fairly extensive research program there and one of the unique things that we have is what's called the Intermountain Heart Collaborative Study. Okay. And that has been in, con with, in collaboration with many of our patients who over the years, over the past 20 years, when they come to the heart hospital, they have willingly signed consent and given us a blood sample test. And so we've frozen that away and we watch and see what happens to them. And by doing that, we now have 
be able to follow and check things and we've been able to check and understand what are the underlying causes of heart disease and partly it's because of the fact that all of these people we have 30,000 blood samples frozen that we can now look at and evaluate and determine what is it that predicts whether you're going to have heart disease and how can we prevent it wow. and I just like to express appreciation to all of our patients who have so kindly participated in this study over the years absolutely I mean you're really uh, doing some amazing things at Intermount Medical Center Heart Institute and we'd love we'd love you coming in and sharing and we have different guests on we'd love you coming in and sharing such good information with us okay uh, while I'm building these wraps so we can try them tell me um, t tell us and educate us on what are the signs when someone is having a heart attack be happy to and it's important for people to know that because when you're having a heart attack it's because artery is blocked because of a blood clot on top of the cholesterol buildup okay. and when that happens heart muscle is dying and when it dies it dies rapidly and if we can open up the artery which we can do if you come to the hospital then we can save heart muscle and so okay. it's important to know what sort of symptoms they are some of the common symptoms are pressure in the chest uh, it's called angina okay. also shortness of breath and an impending sense of doom if you just feel like I'm about to die you might be. and <laughs> therefore happy. you should come call 911 immediately okay. even if it's a false alarm it's much more safe to have a false alarm rather than to miss a real heart attack okay. but pain Let's in the chest that radiate radiates into the left arm oftentimes most sometimes in the right arm okay. very good thank you so much doctor for coming in and for the great information my pleasure and if you want the recipe, head to fox13now.com, search curried turkey wraps.